The Road Ahead, sponsored by RTC. Hi, I'm Annie Woods for The Road Ahead with RTC. The RTC is continuing to work on the Southeast Connector, and that includes planting vegetation that will enhance the project. Here to tell us more about it is Southeast Connector Project Manager, Garth Oaksoll. Thanks so much for being with us today, Garth. So tell us about this reseeding project. Yeah, so with the project, we had to move a lot of dirt around, not only to build the roadway, but also do our flood mitigation and environmental restoration. So with that, we didn't want to leave the area just as bare dirt that could blow away and dust in the future. So we're doing a reseeding project right now. We're planting multiple different types of seed depending on where we're at within the project. And is this the ideal time to be planting seeds in the area? Yeah, it actually is. As we enter the cooler months, you're not going to see a lot of growth from the seeds, but the roots are really going to have a chance to, to take hold and get established so that when the warmer weather comes next spring, we'll see that vegetation pop and really come to life. And how are you ensuring that this vegetation is going to be successful? Well, not only are we doing a temporary irrigation system to, again, help that the seeds grow, but we're using a mixture of recycled newspaper, a lightweight binding agent, and then obviously the seeds as well. And what that does is that creates a thin crust that helps hold the seeds in place and prevents the dirt from being blown away. But then the newspaper works to hold moisture and retain that so the seeds have an optimal opportunity to grow. Fantastic. So how much longer will the RTC be out here planting seeds? Well, we're going to be out here for quite a while doing the seed mix. We're also planting over 600 trees, and a lot of folks will see those starting to come to life and, and grow north of Pembroke. For as far as the seeds go, north of Pembroke Drive, we're mostly done. Between Pembroke and Mira Loma, we'll hit that later on this fall. And then between Mira Loma and South Meadows, we'll hit that next spring as the project starts coming to completion. Great, Garth. Well, thank you for all that wonderful information. If you'd like to learn more on this topic, you can always visit rtcwashoe.com and join RTC on Facebook and on Twitter. I'm Annie Woods for The Road Ahead with RTC. This is your RTC. The Road Ahead, sponsored by RTC.